Okay, this is the G3 extension kit. So uh, this is the form factor here. Basically, it takes all the audio out of the back of G3 and puts it in a 2U rack, which fits into sliding rack drawers or can actually just be put uh, in a pedal board. So then what you can do is, you know, put your pedals in a rack or, you know, in the board and you can have this out with your amplifier, um, sort of with the amp or at the back of the stage and then you can run the floor controller unit just using a seven pin DIN cable. So yeah, that sits at your feet and all of your pedals and everything sit off stage. So yeah, that's, that's really cool. The other similar unit that we have is called the G3 hub. So you see it's the same form factor as the extension kit. The difference with the hub, um, we've designed this. So I, you know, doing work for um, Biffy Clyro, and some stuff I've done for James Bay and you know some of these big touring artists, they'll have a tech that sits offside with all their gear and the tech will have a controller and they'll have a controller on stage and those controllers mirror each other. Um, so if the artist you know walks off somewhere, the tech can change the presets or the artist comes back and starts you know changing presets and, and basically those units talk to each other. Well, this is the hub. So it's similar to the extension kit, except this gives you the option to have up to six floor controllers, basically you know, like this one. You know, one can be with the tech. I know in Biffy, uh, Simon was had, I think four units sort of scattered around the stage. So yeah, this gives you the ability to have up to six um, floor controllers, all running back to, um, you know, the, the pit, where all your gear is kept and, you know, one there for the tech. Um, but the thing is all of the controllers are all synced up. So you press a preset on any one of those and they'll all change.